Hello and welcome to the Street Crime UK YouTube channel. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Today we look at the care worker who seduced a high rolling poker player and lured him to his death in a honey trap robbery is facing jail. Leonie Granger, 25, from Balmoral Road, Gillingham, has been found guilty of manslaughter at the Old Bailey. Mehmet Hassan, a father of three and professional gambler, was found lying in a pool of blood in his Islington flat after his sister alerted police. Former Upbury Manor pupil targeted Mr. Hassan, 56, after spotting him flashing his high roll of £15 notes at an exclusive casino in London's Mary Fair district. The flirtatious party girl, who was tired of her stressful and low paid job at the care home for dementia sufferers, led Mr. Hassan to believe he could wine and dine her into his bed. But after he took her back to his flat, on their second date, she made her excuses and walked out, leaving the door open for two robbers. Her boyfriend, Chiron Jackson, and his friend, Nicholas Chandler, both 28. Mr. Jackson and Mr. Chandler kicked Mr. Hassan to death while ransacking his flat in Islington, North London, before fleeing the scene with £3,000. The officers broke down the door of his Islington flat in North London. They found Mr. Hassan lying in a pool of blood on the floor of his bedroom. Visible shoe print on his cheek, a broken nose and other injuries revealed he had been kicked and stamped on in a vicious and sustained attack. The flat had been ransacked and the TV and Mr. Hassan's mobile phone were missing. A film was found at Miss Granger's phone showing the trio holding bundles of £50 notes and laughing. Mr. Chandler can be seen spraying money over the floor, while Mr. Jackson, wearing a gas mask, stuffs the cash into his underpants. The jury cleared Miss Granger of murder, but convicted her of manslaughter by a majority of 10 to 2, and conspiracy to falsely imprison. During the trial, Miss Granger admitted agreeing to take part in the robbery, but claimed she did not think Mr. Hassan would be harmed. Miss Granger visibly shook and fought back tears as the guilty verdicts were delivered. Mr. Jackson and Mr. Chandler were both convicted of murder, robbery and conspiracy to falsely imprison Mr. Hassan. They were also convicted of violent in two raids on a casino in the weeks before the murder and possession of an imitation firearm. Mr. Hassan's sister, Mayra Musa, said in her statement, Our lives have been altered forever and our happiness shattered. She describes her brother as full of compassion and humanity, but was a witty and professional poker player. His daughter, Stephanie Hassan, said, We cry ourselves to sleep every night. We will never get to meet any of his grandchildren, see us grow up, or be here for myself or my brother's wedding days or give me away. DCI Mr. Andy Partridge of the Met's Homicide and Major Crime Command said, Mehet Hassan was lured into a honey trap by Leonie Granger, having been targeted for his affable nature and success at the casino tables. Miss Granger realised Mr. Hassan kept significant quantities of cash in his flat and cooked up a plan to rob him with her associates Nicholas Chandler and Chiron Jackson. The violence inflicted on Mr. Hassan was horrific and it appears from the comments made by Miss Granger and overheard by a taxi driver on the night of the murder that the gang were intent on finding that cash whatever the cost. People who know Mr. Hassan, his family, friends, associates, describe him as a likeable and generous man. His death was senseless, motivated by the greed of three people who exploited his generosity in the most callous manner imaginable. So what are your thoughts about Miss Granger and how she sought to rob Mr. Hassan of his wealth by using two of her associates to ransack his apartment which led to the brutal beating and death of Mr. Hassan? Please share your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for joining us and until next time, stay safe.